All right, then let's go just a bit down to the CAF Confederation Cup. This time we have another representative that's Rangers International. Uh, they will also be in action this weekend. Um, Larry Rangers, uh, you know, in terms of reputation, a lot bigger than uh, the Lobby, Lobby Stars. stars yeah. And some would say they're playing in a lesser competition, in quotes, mm -hmm. and they have a better chance of going all the way. I agree with you. Uh, Benga Gumbata has been there before. The coach of uh, Rangers International mm -hmm. took Sunshine Stars to the semi-final mm -hmm. of the Kafka, uh, Confederation Cup many years ago. He is someone who can do it again. Um, and he's got, um, what, the compliment of a couple of his players who, he, um, uh, who did the magic for him last year. Remember Excellent that as at the 70th minute in the FA Cup final against Cano Pilas, wow. they were losing three goals to nil what a comeback. until they uh, magically equalized three goals uh, scored three goals in war, 15 minutes, and they went to penalties, and that is exactly why they are here. But mm -hmm. what they still have um, people like Kevin Itoya, right. they still have um, Nana Bolsu in goal. So you would expect that um, Rangers will at least under Gwenga Gumbote. Yes. I'm repeating that name again yeah. because yeah. Very he's a veteran <laughs> when it comes to game management. You mm. would expect that um, he will be able to, to do something on, 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 on the content. Home. Exactly. Mm. And they start off against Bantu of Lesotho. No disrespect to that country. We're not on the same level. Mm -hmm. you're, you're very correct. All right, you're so, very correct. So there are nothing but three points for Rangers International. That's going to be on Saturday and Sunday. Let's move on now. Let's talk about the Nigerian Professional Football League. Uh, it's back finally. And uh, it's going to kick off on Sunday. Absolutely. We can't wait for it to start. And if you look at... It's different from what we've been saying. We have Group A and, B. and Group B. Right. So in Group A, you just have uh, two matches because of the newly promoted side. Yeah. So they are taking a break, just mm -hmm. relax after that grueling uh, tournament. They had a Super 8 yes. they finished yesterday. Exactly. And now the Group A, you have Quarry United and Sunshine Stars in Group B. You have Aimba and MFM. It, MFM was a baptism of fire. <laughs> it's it's a real baptism of you're fire. You're traveling. You're all, traveling all the way to Aimba. I don't mm. envy them. Aimba yeah. will be hoping. They, they, they've not played on the continent now for what? Okay. They're missing this year. I think they mm -hmm. played last year, but they didn't really do well. No. So they'll be hoping to, you know, make an immediate comeback into that. Group B on the screen. Um, Adawa was away to Nasarawa. We find it by way to Plateau United, Heartland, at Kano Pillars, and then Aqua United, um, El Canoe Warriors. Kano Pillars have to put away the disappointment of last season, of where you know they didn't even win any trophy. They didn't even um, they didn't they lost the. FA Cup under, Listen, you know... Because we had 24 matches instead of 18. <laughs> this <laughs> is not even end, but do you think they would have made up so, the gap? So, the, 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 the target now, the it. target right now is to finish amongst the top two. Okay. You know, that's the immediate target, to finish mm -hmm. amongst the top two Get in your back group. In the and then, once you finish top two, you then go into this playoff where um, semi-final um, between Group A, A and, and then Group, group B. B. Uh, so, then we'll see the final... Um, Champions or winners. Mm. Okay, it's going to be very funny talking about MPFL like that group A and B, <laughs> not NNL right now. The book go on the break quickly. Let's play it for the Nigerian women's football. We've almost forgotten that the league hasn't been concluded simply because there is a Super 4 to be played. And just yesterday, the uh, league... Uh, board members actually released the date for the Super 4 to start and it's going to be starting on the 24th of this month and there you have the fixtures there Biasa Queens and Sunshine Queens being action on the opening day also Nassau Amazons and Rivers Angels the winner of the ATL Cup will be in action on that day also and the time for the game one is 2 p.m. the second one is 4 p.m. it's going to be at the Agege Stadium and of course they have a rest day the next day which is 25th and on the 26th, they'll have the third place match at 2 p.m. And, of course, the final match at 4 p.m. So whoever gets this one is just there. So there's no round robin. Just play the two games. Whoever wins, play third game. And the other one gets to play the other one. That's the way it is in that one. So we're waiting for 24 to 26 for the Nigerian Women's Football League Super 4. Let's go over to the papers uh, quickly. Let's start with Sporting Life. That's the one. Uh, a lot of very interesting headlines uh, to take a look. Mikel is talking and says uh, he cannot wait to return and wants to start against Seychelles and against Egypt as well. So that's the captain of the team wants to play after a while. <laughs> I also I will get your thoughts on that quickly. Uh, Real Madrid joined Manchester United in battle for £50 million. Koulibaly, this is an absolute lie. There's no way this guy is going to go for £50 million. Arguably the best he'll defender get, in the he'll world. He'll get closer. Right you get close to 100. 100. 100. I'm saying it's yeah. a lot oh, more. Oh, okay. I see what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. I, I, 50 million pounds, that's you're chicken correct. change. Yeah, exactly. Veggie Van Dyke went for what? 75, 75. million. Right. And this has got to be the hottest property right now, right now. in, in yes. world football as a defender. So 
it would definitely match that. Definitely, or even <laughs> surpass it. Barcelona wants Kane uh, to replace Suarez. Liverpool are uh, quoted uh, 50 million pounds uh, for Tarkovsky. Ramsey Juventus medical that's going to be on Sunday. And indeed, he didn't do enough. Uh, to be in the calf. That's like, 11. I'll that's according to like. Celeste, Celeste and Babayaro. So I'll speak Pigeon on that one. Not like. You Celeste and Babayaro, is, that's a lie. How can you tell me that Indidi did not merit that calf 11 based on his performance for Leicester all through the season? He was the mainstay. I mean, he was the number one name on club hmm? post team every match day, apart from Jamie Vardy. What are you then telling me that he didn't do well? So, who were those on the team that actually did well? What? Hmm. Yeah, they put Party. Um, party. party. They put um, Navigator. Navigator. Come on, Nabiketa. Eric Bae. Nabiketa is okay. How? I agree Hatsi with the others. Okay. I agree with the others. Eric Bae. You don't agree with this one. How? All right. Celeste so Mbabayaro, Larry Pino. <laughs> I don't agree, Celeste. So you should <laughs> level the Samurai. <laughs> okay, let's move to Sporting Sun here. This one talking about all-time Nigerian players' assets. Amike Dwarfs, Mbanzins, and Moses worth 57 million in Chinese money. He wants to join another Chinese club. That's the story coming from our sporting son this morning, and Mario Pocket might use 15 million quid. <laughs> this is sad. Yeah, that's not Barcelona to offload Coutinho for Neymar. No, oh. this is not going to happen. Oh. Then Amari e e Jet, Israel, or Turkey move. Where is it going to go to? Fenambache joins Moses Riz. Okay. Moses. <laughs> He has to start playing again for, Which and he, club? He, he's even, he's, he's not, to make it worse, he's not even playing for his national team. He's retired from his national team. So um, I don't have a lot of pity for him. Um, but he, he, under Conte, it looked as his best position is the wing back role. Yeah. And um, Sari Ball is not actually, yeah. doesn't favor the wing back position. So it looks like he's supposed to requirement, even in the FA Cup, he didn't even make the squad when um, Charles. In, uh, Charles um, Hudson Hodo Odoi okay. and the smaller lads were getting games. Moses didn't even play. So it tells you that he needs to find another club, maybe a loan move, and then get his groove, get wow. his groove back. Yeah. Okay, get his groove back. He needs that. The last one is a uh, complete sport. And Mikel Igat Zigalo keen on EPL return mm. and warrant issued for Ronaldo's DNA. Okay, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, you know what happened, right? Their <laughs> sorts will never go away. <laughs> Thank you so much for the fine time to join us this morning. Thank you. All right. Thank you for watching. I'm Cecilia Morgan. I'm Tyler Salam. Enjoy the rest of your day.